Today, I will be taking you into Pearl Springs and showing you the Mules National Golf Club. The clubhouse and the course. So when you first come in, you're gonna have to take a little bit of a windy scenic route down to the, the clubhouse and to the hitting greens. As you can see, there's also some bike and walking lanes on the side of the road. This is also a very popular place for people to come out and hike and go on bike, uh, walks. There's uh, also trails in the woods for people to hike. Um, just any, a lot of people like to come out here and just enjoy the nature for recreational use and stuff. You see here, here's a sign for the Mules National Golf Club and the Traditions Restaurant. We're gonna be going up here. So it's very scenic up here. It was just newly remodeled too. It's, uh, so you can see there's a the clubhouse. We got some golf carts. It's pretty popular. Um, not only there is the clubhouse here, there's the merchandise store. Um, there's also the restaurant up here where people can eat. They can reserve it out for wedding receptions, um, class reunions, any kind of gatherings or anything like that. And if you see in here, when we come in this way, you can see that there is a designated spot for handicapped accessible parking. So I'll go ahead and drive there and show you guys that. You see some of the extra golf carts. So when you come in here, here's a the location where you can find the handicapped accessible parking. It looks like we got about four spots. And if you look out this way, you can see some of the the green too. This is a very nice golf course. Uh, lots of people come and travel far away just to play on this golf course. It's very well maintained. Um, if I was a golfer myself, I would probably come here and play. I am not a golfer though. I could not hit the ball straight. So I have not ever come here and play before. So I'll take you back around here. As you said, there's the, the clubhouse. You can see we got our logo mule. Um, if you go up away this way, you'll see the practice putting green. This is where people can go before they want to hit either nine or 18 holes to practice their putting or chipping game. We got a little bit of a sand bunker there and some practice putting. Um, there's a decent amount of parking up here. They do have a hitting range here too, so if you don't want to play the full game, you can just um, just hit off the tee and get some practice shots in. They also do have a very nice outdoor seating area for if you do want to eat. I will drive you guys up there and give you a look at that. If you see there's some of these golf carts up here too, they are a little bit different. They're a little bit newer and they actually have the Mules logo on them, which is kind of cool. As you can see, so that's kind of cool. Um, as you can see, here's the outdoor seating area. It's very big, wide. It actually overlooks the 18th hole. So as, you can, as you're eating, you can watch people play golf if you'd like. So that's just a little bit of a drive-by of the Mules National Golf Course. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you back next week.